Redditors who are married to someone with an identical twin. What are your feelings towards that twin? My boyfriend's twin is like a brother to me. It's nice to be able to talk to him when I'm concerned about my so, since he knows how he thinks. When his twin says I have nothing to worry about, I know there isn't. Finally a nice response. Everything above so far was my so's twin is evil. This was nice. I'm an identical twin and the demi and my husband are getting married. My mother says to me, hey, did you know in high school that husband really had the hearts for my twin sister? Weird, how apparently he had told my mother this in confidence when he went and bought my wedding present. And she felt the need to tell me this on my wedding day. I bring it up constantly now because it crushed me on my wedding day, and now I find it hilarious. Dash. What a horrible thing to say to you on your wedding day. I'm married to an identical twin. I always say I married the hot one. There are more personality differences than you think. I hope you're not my wife's twin's husband, because I married the hot one. I married an identical twin. They have a very similar personality so I get along with my wife's twin very well. When her twin comes to visit they will exchange clothes sometimes. I saw my wife come out and go back to the room. Then saw my wife's twin come out with a different outfit. Thought it was my wife. She went back in another time and changed shirts again. I was getting annoyed because I figured it was my wife changing for the third time. Nope. Just the twin trying on two shirts. When we got married my mom was helping my wife put together her bouquet of flowers. She had to get her makeup done so she left the room and my wife's twin stepped in without missing a beat. My mom went on to have a 20 minute heart to heart with who she thought was her future daughter in law. I finally overheard something and told my mom it was her twin. Poor mom. Just mark your wife's hand with a sharpie. Not married, but an ex relationship. Let's call the twins Chad and Charles. I had maybe one class with Charles, and we never spoke. Then, I started to have classes with Chad, and we were inseparable. He wasn't only my boyfriend, but also my best friend. Anyways, he broke up with me out of nowhere. Every time I saw him after that, he would act like a supreme butthole towards me. I never knew what I did to deserve that, but it hurt a lot. When high school ended, Chad went to an out of state college, and Charles ended up going to the same college as me. Fast forward to the first day of sophomore year of college. Charles and I had the same class together. It's a huge lecture hall. He could sit wherever he wants, but he chooses to sit next to me. I didn't even notice until he said hi to me. I just responded hey back. Then, he proceeded to apologize for being mean to me in high school. I was super confused. But I figured he felt bad that he stopped talking to me after Chad and I broke up. I said, oh, don't worry about that. It was so long ago. If anything, it's your brother who should apologize. My brother he asked. Yep, yeah, Chad was such a dong after we broke up. Seriously, frick that guy. Now, I knew that I was saying this to his brother, but the two of them weren't that close. I doubted that he would ever tell Chad that I said that. Even if he did, I wouldn't have cared. Charles just responded with, oh right, Chad. Then, class began. We started taking notes. Charles was writing with his left hand. I thought it was odd and told him, wait, I never knew you were left hander too. I thought it was just Chad. He just gave me a little nod, and we went back to taking notes. Because I can be kind of slow sometimes. Things didn't click in my brain until after class. I rushed to Facebook and looked at Chad's profile. He had just transferred to the same college as me. I was talking to him the entire time. Edit. I'm making this edit after almost two weeks. I was going to do it before, but I didn't think anyone else would read it. Anyways, there were a few comments telling me to reach out to him and ask him what went wrong. So I went to Facebook and looked him up. Turns out I'm blocked. Then, I remembered that he blocked me right after he broke up with me. Not only on Facebook but on all social media. On our college's student portal, there's a tab where you can look at the list of all the students in your class. But that's how I ended up finding out that it was Chad I was talking to the entire time. So yeah, I basically have no way to communicate with him unless I see him in person. If I do see him and start talking, hopefully it won't be Charles and I end up making a fool out of myself again haha. <laughs> I thought you were gonna say that Chad was actually a nickname for Charles and that it turns out they weren't twins at all but the same person the entire time. 
married to an identical twin. It's funny. I met my husband on Tinder, and both him and his twin had profiles. I often think, what if I would have swiped right on his twin first it most definitely wouldn't have worked. Not because I dislike my husband's twin, but because our personalities simply don't click that way. Regardless, I have a very close relationship with my husband's twin. I think of him as my protector, and I hope he thinks the same of me. When he moved to our town for a job, he actually lived with us for 6 moss, despite the fact that my husband and I were newly married. I look back on that time very fondly, we grew really close. I feel very lucky to have such a great relationship with him. My dad is an identical twin, so I have an uncle dad. That's weird to type and say out loud. My grandfather who lived in a different state was an identical twin. I met his brother for the first time at my grandfather's funeral. He looked and sounded just like my grandpa. It was pretty difficult to process in that moment. All I can say is that I'm definitely married to the nice one. Married to an identical twin going on 8 years. When I first found out I thought it would be wacky and entertaining like a movie, but it sucks but. Her twin is a psycho and one of the worst people I've ever met. She wants to be the alpha twin. They are so competitive about everything. Been married to her twin for going on 8 years, and dating several years in high school. Before that too. Her sister was a bit crazy, but she's mellowed out a lot now. I have a friend who's married to an identical triplet. One time he was visiting his sill and she asked him to leave the room because she was going to nurse her baby. His reply, I've already seen everything you have so no need for me to leave. The sill wasn't too happy with that response. I'm not identical but I am a triplet where my brother and I look very similar. All of my brother's ex-GFS bond with me afterwards, even if we didn't like each other before. I think it's because we both know that my brother's a complete butthole. I'm an identical twin. My twin is dead. Wife has no feelings as far as I can tell. Comma I'm an identical twin. My twin is dead. Same here. Sorry for your loss. I dated a twin. Her sister's boyfriend had the same car as me. Sounds like a lie so that you could bone both of them lol. My sister-in-law's ex-husband is a twin. He left her and it took her a long time to move on because she would keep hanging out with the twin and his wife. Twin is my wife's evil copy. Wouldn't touch that mess if my life depended on it. Not much of anything. He's my brother-in-law. And honestly, they look less alike than some fraternal twins I know. They have very different personalities. And his brother is totally not my type. That didn't stop me from asking some curious questions though. 1. If we were to find my husband was infertile, would he agree to using his brother as a donor? Not in the I'd have sex with him way because you. I mean, it's literally the exact same DNA. Hubby said definitely no. 2. If we have kids, and he has kids, they are cousins. But are they also technically half siblings, since they're half identical DNA half other mothers? Hubby called me weird. I think these are legitimate questions. My twin brother and I had this conversation when he found out his cancer treatments were going to leave him sterile. Without a doubt I'd have donated for him, but considering he was single at the time, and sadly didn't win that fight, it wasn't ever something I had to do, but I would have in a heartbeat. Same DNA, I don't know, it wouldn't have been weird to me. I am married to one of inseparable identical twins. My wife and her sister are two peas in a pod and extremely dependent on each other. I knew when I married one I was marrying half of the other one too. D. But I love my wife so much including her sister in the picture too. My wife's sister is always at our place as much as my wife is at her sister's place. We do have a good dynamic. Understanding about the relationships and we have no boundaries broken. Way late to the party, but I know a woman whose husband cheated on her with her identical twin, then got her twin pregnant, divorced her and married her twin. I guess you could say he liked her better. Thanksgivings just don't happen anymore. These are the kind of stories we came here's for. I'm one of triplets, two girls and a boy. My sister and I are identical but our brother doesn't look anything like us. Most people don't believe us when we tell them who our brother is. We're not married but my boyfriend also has a twin brother. They look a lot alike, but it was easy telling them apart early on. 
My boyfriend is more social and relaxed with people while his brother is more introverted and sometimes even socially awkward. Because I myself have a twin. It's not weird to me so I treat his brother the same way as if they weren't twins. Yes hello. You've summoned me. Satan I mean. Me. Your twin sister. My husband is an identical twin. It's weird, because sometimes, especially when walking around or doing something, I really have to watch out not to mix them up. Then, when sitting down or whenever it is absolutely clear who is who, I find the twin looks nothing like my husband and I find him kind of unattractive. D. I went to school with three sets of identical twins. After getting to know them you notice the small differences. People got freaked out that I could easily tell the difference between them. I am an identical twin and all my brother's ex-GFs always distanced themselves from me even if we were friends prior to them dating. But his current GF and I are very close. I really hope they get married. They have my seal of approval. Not quite what you were asking but I dated a twin in high school. We were both very reserved, quiet people. His twin brother was much more outgoing and happened to have a girlfriend that looked a lot like me. Same hair color and build, at least. They would make out everywhere with absolutely no shame. One day my boyfriend and I got pulled into the principal's office to talk about our inappropriate behavior at school. It was humiliating. When we're finally able to stammer through our explanation that no, you've got the wrong couple. The principal was very kind about it and we had a good laugh. But I'm sure I was tomato red for the whole conversation. That sounds like a good side plot to a teen movie. I'm a twin. But despite being identical we don't really look alike. I had some birth defects that stunted my growth. And she's 6 inches taller. My husband was friends with my sister before we started dating. They met while doing a play together. And we didn't meet until a few months later. They actually played a couple and had kissing scenes. So he's one of probably few people who can say he's kissed twins. While he thinks my sister looks nice. And she is objectively pretty. He's never been attracted to her. Holy crap I think you're my boyfriend's female counterpart. He's also got an identical twin who's 6 inches taller thanks to birth defects stunting his growth. And I also kissed his twin in a non-romantic context before we started dating. My husband was born with a mostly absorbed identical twin. The doctors removed it and all he has is a tiny scar. But I crap you not he has two personalities. Sometimes I think that half of his brain is one twin and the other half is the other. He also refers to himself as we a lot without much thought. Have an upvote for some Stephen King crap. Okay, story time. I met a guy on a dating app. We'll call him T. We talked for a bit and then met up at a bar for a few drinks. As far as dates go, it was pretty awkward. T was pretty cute, but he was a bit of a disaster. At one point he mentioned he had a brother who he thought I'd get along with pretty well, and I, jokingly, asked him for his brother's number. I mean the date was going terribly, what did I have to lose? He didn't give me the number. The date ended, we went our separate ways. Then, months later, I meet another guy through the same dating app. We start talking, come to find out, he is T's brother. Not just any brother, he is his identical twin. We hit it off. His personality is basically the opposite of T's. We're still together today. Life is weird. Plot twist. What if T never really had a twin but pretended to be his brother and switched personalities to get a second chance with you? I dated twin brothers in 6th grade. One asked me out one day and then the other asked me out later that week. I didn't realize what a boyfriend was then. I also didn't realize you can't have two at the same time even if they are twins. They were both arrested for hate crimes as adults. I guess I dodged two bullets. Honestly, that caught me off guard. Haha, <laughs> glad you were able to avoid that bad news. I'm married to an identical twin. They are very dependent of each other but fight like you won't believe. I have tons of funny stories because I lived with both of them for a little while. When they get angry, they kinda black out and call each other nasty stuff that makes no sense. For example, they will call each other ugly cows. They are 100% identical. Also, they both sleepwalk a lot. Like every night, I woke up once to my wife, then girlfriend, putting her rollerblades on at night while her sister was walking around the apartment with a stover top like a tray and a wooden spoon. She was dreaming of being a waitress I guess. 
I just went back to bed. Also, you know that scene in Paranormal Activity where the wife stands by the bed staring at her husband for hours. Yep, that's just a Tuesday for me. As for my feelings toward her twin, she's like a sister only, nothing more. OMG I couldn't handle that happening while I sleep. My dad is a twin. My mom actually dated his twin first and when they broke up, my dad asked her out. My uncle is now married to a nice woman, with the same first name as my mom. My sister-in-law is married to an identical twin. The only noticeable difference between the two is the twin stands up straighter. From what I understand, she is incredibly attracted to the twin, obviously, right, and doesn't allow herself to be drunk around him. It causes me anxiety to think about that. Edit. I'm not the twin. Sil is my wife's sister. My auntie lost her husband and father of her child in the war. She married his twin brother afterwards. Not married but my girlfriend has an identical twin and she is her complete polar opposite and a giant C. I always tell her it's easy to know which of them is the evil twin. Ursula. I love my husband's twin like he's my brother too. He even calls me sis. They look so different that I haven't had any and conflicting feelings. And would never mistake them unless their backs were turned to me. My husband wears his hair a little longer and is clean shaven. And is typically dressed for the office. His brother keeps his hair buzzed short and wears a long beard. And dresses to work outside. They sound like the property brothers. Not married, but I'm in a long term relationship with an identical twin. And as far as I know, I'm the only person who has kissed both of them. I actually was friends with both twins for years before I started dating one of them. I met my current BF first and had a huge crush on him, but he was very reserved and hard to get close to. When I met his twin, I had a small crush on him, just because he reminded me of my crush, but was more outgoing and easier to befriend. His twin is super flirty too, and ended up kissing me while I was working at a kissing booth at a weird valentine's day party. That ended up being slightly awkward when my BF and I finally got together after 4 years of friendship, but he knows about it and doesn't really care. And now that I've got the real thing, I don't have any attraction to his brother and just see him as a good friend. Sure, he's got the same facial structure and mannerisms as my boyfriend, but they have very different styles. The twin is a cool guy and cute enough, but my boyfriend has been through hardships that his twin has not, and he's developed a unique depth of character and humility from his experiences that makes him a very sexy, magnetic person. Waiting for the exciting plot twist in which someone dating an identical twin also pretends to be an identical twin to be able to have a relationship with both of the twins. My husband is actually a triplet. His brother is a K. Hair on my nerves. Their personalities are completely different. His sister is cool but I don't see that going anywhere either. I'm actually quite fond of him. But my husband's twin is gay and my husband is not, so I imagine that changes the dynamics quite a bit. We talk about guys and relationships and watch a lot of real housewives together. The three of us lived together for a while before my husband and I got married and it was fun. Sometimes I'll look at him and think huh, so that's what my husband would look like if he showered and shaved and cared about his wardrobe. Good to know. Huh, so that's what my husband would look like if he showered and shaved and cared about his wardrobe. Good to know. This made me laugh, as I'm trying to decide if I should shave this month. My wife has a twin sister who was my ex during our teen years. I treasure the moments that I had with her in the past and being able to grow together now that she's my sister-in-law. Fun fact. Her twin sister is married to my buddy who was the ex to my wife. We sometimes joke about it wondering how life would be if we didn't swap partners. I'm married to her twin and she asked me if I found her sister attractive. I said, of course, I do. You're twins. If I find you attractive, then it would be illogical for me not to find her attractive. 2. Thankfully, she laughed and agreed with me. Went out with a twin back in the day. Their nickname for each other was ugly. Clara and B. In all seriousness, this has been the case for some couples where the twin partner ends up developing fertility issues. Whilst their twin has not, the fertile twin, plan B, can offer their sperm or eggs for in vitro fertilization. Or, if female, just elect to be the birth mother herself, resulting in a child who is, in every way, 
genetically the offspring of the couple. It's pretty cool. This mouse is looking for friends in the comments comment mouse boy to befriend him. If you are new to the channel, you can subscribe. I publish new videos every day. Until then, check another video. Or don't. Either way, have a great day you magnificent people.